Welcome back everybody. I'm with my friend Steve. We're up here in the mountains of Colorado. Look at there. We have the Blackstone Adventure Ready Van and today we're gonna make a breakfast cheesesteak with a sriracha mayo. Let's give it a try. Today we have the Blackstone 17 inch Adventure Ready Griddle. I'm on high heat. So windy. Getting a lot of wind today. One of our chairs just blew away, so uh, back to the cooking. I found this trick when we were out filming in Philadelphia a few years ago at Jim Steaks. It's a little uh, metal food can and we take our cheese whiz. <laughs> Everything's blowing away here. Cheese whiz straight down in that can. And then this could be on the griddle top. It can get nice and hot and it can sit there until we're ready to put it on our sandwich. So that's Pike's Peak <laughs> in the background there. That's America's Mountain. Uh, I just, I'm laughing because I was just trying to think of the stats about the mountain. It's the second most visited mountain in the world behind Mount Fuji in Japan. This is gonna be a breakfast cheesesteak. So of course, we're gonna put some egg in there. Steve's holding my, <laughs> my egg plate over there. Woo! <laughs> It's a little messy when you're out in the field sometimes. Break those eggs apart and whisk them up with a plastic fork. Some oil, cooking oil, uh, no rhyme or reason. That just happens to be a mixture of uh, olive and canola oil. The griddle top nice and oiled. And right here, hopefully you can see that. Thinly shaved elk roast. This is from the elk two years ago, the one where Steve killed the mountain lion and protected us. So I literally just shaved this last night straight out of the freezer with my uh, meat slicer. Of course, when you get a cheesesteak, in a lot of cheesesteak shops out east, they're using bottom round or sirloin or ribeye. Straight down on the griddle top. And I'll season that up with Blackstone's brand new cheesesteak seasoning. A little more cheesesteak seasoning on there. I like a lot of seasoning on my food. Now traditional Philly cheesesteaks, they use onions. Of course I use onions in a lot of my videos, but for breakfast I like a little green pepper. So uh, I like it in my omelets and I like it in my breakfast cheesesteaks. Mix those green peppers up with the steak so we can get everything cooking. Let's cook that egg up. Thank you. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna keep the egg separated. We'll just go ahead and mix that up with the meat. Of course, I guess you could, you could have added cream or milk to your eggs and make them super creamy. But we just want a little bit of egg in here since we're calling this a breakfast cheesesteak. You know the deal if you've been following me for any length of time. I use the Sam's Club White Hoagie Rolls. They have these things in like three sizes and these are the small little slider size here. Turn those rolls a few times. Just get them nice and soft before we cut them up. And I like sriracha, oh my god, it's so windy. And I like sriracha with my eggs, so I figured how about a little sriracha mayo. So a little bit of mayo right there. Of course, it always makes those crazy noises, so we're gonna live with it. I'm not gonna edit those out. <laughs> and sriracha on top, like so. We can, um, I do, the, the, I'll make the sriracha mayo the same way I would make like a cocktail sauce. I kind of just go by color. I look at that and say, mm, you know, I want a little more red. Something like that. 
Here's how we're gonna do this. We have our bread knife over here. Hopefully you can see this in the, um, in the can with the cheese. And we'll come straight over here. Oh yeah, just like they do in Philly. Like that. And grab a spatula with my uh, egg, meat, and pepper mixture right there like so of course i dropped half of it that's fine we're we're eating in the field here and we'll drizzle a little extra cheese whiz on top cheese whiz in the roll again these sam's club white hoagie rolls for my money it, uh, they are the best tasting mass produced bakery roll that you can get across the country of course you know people out there in philly they get those amoroso rolls and all that stuff but i don't live in philly so I recommend, I'm dropping meat everywhere, I recommend these uh, Sam's Club rolls. A little bit of that um, cheese whiz on top. Oh yeah, we can't forget about the sriracha mayo as well. And now the icing on the cake, the sriracha mayo. Suppose you could have a little squeeze bottle for this, but uh, we're just running and gunning here in the woods today. Oh, that looks pretty too, The uh, that peach color of the sriracha mayo, that looks really nice. Take a look at that. <clears throat> Woo! Let's give it a try. I definitely don't want to be a cheese snake, cheese snake, <laughs> cheese steak snob. I'm not from Philadelphia, so I'm not one of those cheese steak snobs. But yeah, you definitely want to have cheese whiz or American. You know, it's some kind of processed cheese. That's the flavor you want in a cheese steak, whether you're making it traditional or non-traditional like this. Mm. Loving the sriracha mayo. It mixes real nice. The, uh, the, the creamy mixture, the double creamy mixture, I guess, of the uh, cheese whiz with the sriracha mayo. Mm. That's beautiful. The buns are great. That sriracha mayo is killer. I'm the kind of guy that likes to drizzle, you know, extra ketchup on his burger and whatnot. And yeah, for sure, we're going in with extra sriracha mayo. Hopefully you can see that. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Look at that griddle more tour, baby. It's the griddle more or die trying tour up here in the Rocky Mountains. Check out that cool shirt he's wearing. So I got one, the Tobin zone. So our graphic I probably have cheese all over the mouth, but you know, I apologize. So our graphic designers come up with so many cool designs right now so they've created a teespring site that they can put these little one-off shirts like this cool uh, Rocky Mountain logo or the Tobin Zone logo up on there's a link in the description down below or just go to teespring.com uh, and type in Blackstone Griddles Blackstone products you'll see it they got a whole bunch of cool designs up there make sure you're following us on all the social media channels uh, Facebook Instagram all that stuff blackstoneproducts.com of course is your portal this is Todd and Steve. We're up here in Colorado's Rocky Mountains. And it, what, let's see, what are we calling these? We're calling these the, um, the breakfast cheesesteak with sriracha mayo. Breakfast cheesesteak with sriracha mayo. So until next time, this is Todd and Steve. We're saying praise the Lord and pass the breakfast cheesesteak with sriracha mayo.